beautiful people in front of me 15 lps and 12 inches which will i put in my online overview to get a better overview of what i have and immediately also put them alphabetically right behind me let's do it it's gonna be a nice one hi i'm the hip-hop collector hiphopcollector.com so i randomly took some vinyl there on the left side from me just random took like 15 12 inches and lps but all nice ones really classic stuff in here so let's start first up the ghost face killer fish scale what a great album this is ghost face always delivering with his nice flow and also great albums just like this one i really adore this album the champ my favorite track on this one really dope ghost face killer fish scale next up we stay with the woo this time with capadonna the pillage can't go wrong with capadonna always delivering really love that front cover always loved it also the backside nice old school picture next up a 12 inch by digital underground do what you like him packet man remix double a side the typical digital underground artwork really love it this one is a gatefold as you can see really cool to have can't go wrong with digital underground rest in peace shock g we all miss you another 12 inch this time also from the west coast drew down no one loves you i'm a huge drew down fan myself he has really dope albums and this is one of those 12 inches that i regularly play drew down no one loves you and we go on and we go on this time with a limited edition ea ski album that i received from him he saw one of my episodes and sent me over this album which was really dope i'll put the link here to the uh episode that was really nice to really get it directly from him i had a nice conversation with him as well go and check out that episode that was really cool ea ski limited edition producers versus beat makers next up a nice lp dj premiere and bumpy knuckles collection i think most of you will know this one if you do not know this one go and check it out for sure because there's real real nice tracks on this one so cool it also has a different release with only the instrumentals i have that one somewhere here also but this one wow dj premier bumpy knuckles i both met them that was both awesome back to the old days this is a great 12 inch for me personally one of those tracks with a meaning a voice this is the stop the violence movement with self-destruction awesome 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 this is fantastic. Flavor Flav, Just Ice, Kumo D, Doggy Fresh, Daddy O, Karis, One Chuck D, Heavy D, Fruit Quan, Wise, MC Light, D Nice, Miss Melody, MC Delight. <sighs> wow. Classic material. We continue with the 12 inches. This time from the Urban Renewal Program. This is an 12 inch with on one side LP, on the other side Aesop Rock. Nice. Really cool tracks. Go and check them out. This is cool stuff. The Urban Renewal Program. That was awesome. Amazing releases. Next up, in front of me, a DJ collective. Like, wow. The Executioners, previously known as the X Men. Here you have it. Amazing album, really fantastic. 
I'm more of a fan of the first release of them, but this one, whew, super dope as well. Another limited edition colored vinyl, limited to 300 pieces, Core Mega Philosophy, the instrumentals. The instrumentals are dope, but the normal album is crazy good as well. Often overlooked, I think, Cormega is a quality rapper and this album just blew my mind. And to have the instrumentals, which I adore also, is really dope. Next up, a classic album, the JP's, the Jungle Brothers, done by the forces of nature. Another album that you need to have in your collection. This is simply amazing. No skipping allowed on this album. You just put it on and play it till the end. We're getting closer and closer to number 15, but here we are with another 12 inch Prince Poetry and QB. Prince Poetry of Organized Confusion, of course, and QB of Environment. I think I mentioned this one already in a previous episode, so might be possible that I have it twice, which does not occur a lot. This one I bought a long time ago because before the Euro currency in Europe, we had the Belgian francs and this label here still mentions the money, the price actually in Belgian francs. Cool. Next up, Apollo Brown, 38. Super dope album. Really love this one. I think I also have it on cassette. Need to check that. 38, nice. Two more to go. This one, an, one of my favorite Public Enemy albums. The music in our message. So good, that artwork is fantastic. I think it's a bit underrated, this album. Um, because we all know the super classics, uh, but this one stand his ground. It's <sighs> give it up, Bedlam 1313. So, what you're gonna do now? White Heaven, Black Hell, Race Against Time. No, this one is great, great stuff. I'm gonna put it on directly after recording this episode. And the last one for today, a West Coast classic, straight from Oakland. This is Too Short, Short Dogs in the House. Too Short has made a lot of albums, but this one is one of my favorites. Also a great old school picture on the backside. Super nice, Short Dog, ha, <laughs> nice. Too Short album, again, 15 great LPs, 12 inches. I will put them now alphabetically behind me after putting them in my online Discogs overview. Hope you maybe learned something that you did not know that you can go and check out. That's always nice. Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. That's really cool. Appreciate you all and I see you all in the next episode. Peace.